Hello, my name is Denise Jones, and I am the attorney in the award-winning feature film, I Do. You can see it on 2B, Amazon Prime, and... All right, man, peace. We got a breaking update coming out of Atlanta. Now, out almost out of a movie, right? A storyline almost out of a movie. YSL artist, Young Thugs artist, is reportedly dead that's right now his brother actually confirmed it on social media today in a post he put i can't believe i seen you die today bro i did cry my eyes i know what you want me to do and that's go hard for mama daddy our brothers mature and white boy now little key you know um leaves behind the daughter right now he released his final trap album called cleveland Trapped on Cleveland 3 in 2020. Now, we know Cleveland Avenue, you know, uh, we've been hearing it lately with the whole Young Thug indictment. It's a notorious area down there, you know, in Georgia, right there where a lot of people come. Now, his album did include, you know, collaborations from Travis Scott, Young Thug, and Chris Brown. He was really on his way up the ladder in the game. He's getting a lot of support from a lot of different artists. Now, his cause of death has not yet been confirmed. Um, this is just crazy, man. Uh, we have to still wait to see what happens. Um, again, the ironic thing here is that this is Young Thug's artist that he signed to his label. And um, they're saying, you know, not a lot of information is coming out right now, man. But this is definitely, definitely sad. Now, I knew a little bit about him. I seen his name pass here and there. I'm not going to sit up here and act like I listen to a whole bunch of his music. I'll be lying to you to say that. But I definitely heard his name in passing over the last couple of years. And, um, yeah, now Lil' Keith was the sixth of seven, seven, that was signed under Young Thug's record label, YSL, which they say stands for Young Stoner Life. And he's um, under 300 Entertainment as well. Now, we know Young Thug was arrested this week. You know, um, on charges included participating in criminal street gang activity. And um, 28 members were included. Little Key was not one of those people. Now, Little Key defended Young Thug, you know, for the last couple of days, posting YSL is a family, YSL is a label, YSL is a way of life, YSL is a lifestyle. YSL is not a gang. YSL is not a street criminal organization. YSL is not a street gang. YSL is not the mob. Crazy, crazy situation, man. Um, he's definitely going to be missed. Like I said, one of the up and coming, you know, stars that's beginning to emerge on the Atlanta scene before he was passed away. Now a lot of people are saying he was an incredible father, um, you know, brother son all of that just an incredible person gone way way too soon like i said his death was confirmed by his brother on social media today so this is definitely definitely sad a tragic loss to say the least only 24 only 24 years old you never like to see this but we're gonna have to sit back and wait to see what the cause of death is but it's your brother oh god man with a hip-hop news uncensored exclusive and update for you guys um i hate to be giving you guys this news but that's just the nature of the beast here man you have a good night man it's your brother oh god peace